My name's Jacob Kramer. I'm an actor, a student, I play Coupon Overruled, and I'm hosting Family's Stand Up Coast to Coast Tour. I made an appearance at the Ontario Rally for last year's Join the Wave Camp. There were almost 800 students there. It was an amazing experience, so when Family asked me to host this year's tour, well, I jumped at the chance. This is the eighth year of Bullying Awareness Week, and Family's 2010 Stand Up campaign is all about the music. Severia and Family's own Lindsay Hamilton each wrote a stand up anthem specifically for Family and performed them at the rallies. These songs reflect what stand-up is all about, like believing in yourself, being strong, and having confidence. And on top of that, they're just great songs. I couldn't wait to get started. Aside from Toronto, I had never been to any of the cities we were traveling to on tour, and I was really excited to see more of my country. We kicked off the tour in the east. First stop, Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island. Severi and I had some time off before the rally, and we wanted to look around. Apparently, the best way to do that is by hippo. Harbor hippo, that is. The sights were beautiful, but our tour quickly became a test to see if we could get everyone we passed to wave at us. We weren't always successful, but for the most part, mission accomplished. Charlottetown is all about the water, so after some time on land, that's exactly where we went. It was great to get another vantage point of Charlottetown. PEI is seafood heaven, and one thing I had never tried before was oysters. We hit up Clotta Oyster House, and I found out not only am I eating oysters, I'm shucking them. Let me tell you, they are very reluctant to let you in there. But with a few tries, a little help from restaurant owner Liam, and all my fingers intact, voila. It was interesting. I did manage to get it down. <coughs> Severi, on the other hand, well, I have to give her credit. At least she tried. I could have toured around for a week, but it was time to get down to business. We headed out to Cardigan Consolidated, just outside of Charlottetown. Small province, small town equals small school, but these kids gave me the biggest welcome. Now everybody all together. Awesome. I think the coolest part of this year's rallies are the musical performances. Severia so performed her song, Don't Push Me Down. She's only 13 years old. Here's this tiny girl with this big voice. She was amazing. The rallies are such a positive event. The students and teachers always have the greatest time. I have to remind myself that it was something as negative as bullying that brought us there in the first place. But I hope that what we're doing makes a difference. It really feels that way when you're in it. Thank you, everybody. A young girl by the name of Hannah McDonald was the student who nominated Cardigan Consolidated. She was very shy, but I think she was just shocked that we were actually there. She did a very brave thing by publicly taking a stand against bullying in her school. So it was awesome that we could give her something back for that. My name is Hannah McDonald, and I stand up at my school. If anyone is being bullied by someone, I tell them, what would you feel like if someone was doing that to you? PEI for me was all about trying something new, and that applies to stand up as well. For example, reaching out to someone you don't normally hang out with and making a new friend. It was a great start to stand up coast to coast. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Maybe minus the oysters. Oh,